No, baby. Oh, my child. Hey, welcome back or welcome. I'm Brittany and this is the Brittany E. Channel. So, I have been saying for the longest time that I'm gonna start doing styling videos. I'm gonna start styling looks on camera. And I'm gonna give you guys more than just a try on. I'm gonna give you guys the complete look head to toe. And I finally attempted it. Today, we are styling a maxi skirt. Now I've done something like this on my channel before a long time ago, where I took one garment as a base and styled it in a variety of different ways with like different garment pairings. And I'll link that above. It's old y'all, so give me grace. But I'm doing something like that with this video using one garment, a very trendy garment, a maxi skirt, like a maxi skirt. I feel like you can't speak about fashion or hear people speak about fashion without hearing about maxi skirts, more specifically denim. We're not doing denim, mainly because I don't like them. I'm so sorry. I feel like you can't talk about fashion or hear people speak about fashion without hearing about maxi skirts. They were all over the runways last season for spring, summer 23. This past February, they were further emphasized for fall, winter 23. They're here and I don't mind it. So let's style this maxi skirt, which actually isn't a maxi skirt. It's my lounge dress from Skims, which is maxi length. When I recorded this video, I didn't have a maxi skirt, but I think that this piece acts as a perfect maxi skirt for me because I could really play with the length and I like that because I'm a tall girl. I'm 5'9". So let's get into it and let me know what you guys think about this format because I play with the idea of speaking whilst styling versus doing you know the voiceover commentary playback that i'm doing right now so next time i style something which will probably be another popular trend i'll try to speak whilst doing it and you guys will be able to tell me which format that you prefer the most but for now let's react to these different looks that i've put together so here we have the skirt the skirt and I'm going to start with my favorite, favorite little black vest from ASOS, starting with the bottom two buttons open because that in itself is a look. Of course, if I did this, I would wear a, a bra that showed itself less. Then we button the buttons, another look. I'm pairing this with my favorite black mules that I wear time and time again. I will check and see if they're still available and if so I will link them below and this is a look y'all this isn't my first time pairing a classic bottom with this vest I think I did it with some white linen pants before I did it with the silk skirt and here we are doing it with the maxi skirt I really really love this concept it's simple it's sleek it's sexy what do y'all think so here we have this graphic tee and I'm going to make it cropped by tucking it up in the back pairing this oversized denim jacket with it rolling up the sleeves so the body is not too cut off and overwhelmed by this loose fitting silhouette and i'm just gonna pair my chucks with it and here we have an easy peasy casual look Next, we're switching up the crop of the top and we're pairing a cropped blazer, a waiter's blazer. And I also think this is a great look. Pair this with some mules or some chucks. And that too is a fun look. Here I am again with the same crop top and I'm gonna throw a classic blue poplin over top and make it pop with some punchy red accessories. This belt is from a Gabby Fresh fashion to figure dress that I have. And honestly, it goes well with so many things. I love this belt so much. And I definitely wear it more than the dress. 
So I'm taking the shirt and tucking it down into the vest. We don't need the skin showing really. And the belt immediately cinches the waist, okay? We love that. Pop on these little kitten heel mules and here we have a look. This is one of my favorite types of look. This belongs in my quirky art teacher catalog because that's one of my personal favorite things when it comes to dressing that I like to adhere to. Next, we're gonna get rid of the t-shirt. We're gonna crisscross the top. We wanna look cleavage. This one is a little sexy. We're gonna bring the belt back and add our black mules again. Added my favorite pink Gucci glasses. And here we have a look. This look is classic, a little quirky, sexy, sleek. I love this one. This may be one of my favorites. Or this one. This is simple. We have a black cropped, like bralette-esque top from Zara. This gold belt from Zara with the skirt, with the black mules. And I would wear this on any summer night, okay? If it gets a little chilly, grab that cropped blazer again and put it over top. I think this look is perfect. It seems very thought out, and it is. It's thoughtful, but it's very easy and uses the most simple pieces from your wardrobe. This is similar to the look with the vest, except we have this here corset from the Kalana Barfield Brown Target collaboration. Another complete look. Wear it with some chucks, wear it with some heels. If you want to get real fun with the layering, pair a printed bodysuit underneath. Yeah, that's fun. I definitely love how this one turned out. Or you can simply wear the printed top or bodysuit on its own with the skirt. I personally to this one should have added a belt just to break up that stark black with the wild print, just to, you know, add a better transition piece. But I still really like this look. Again, the black mules is perfect. Silk button down, tied up, gold belt with pops of color. Very sleek, very sexy. This silhouette to me just screams like belly dancer. I don't know if it's the hanging tassels, or tassel bobs of the top, if it's the fact that it's like a satin, if it's the fact that the belt has these beautiful jewels and gold, but it really gives me that vibe and I really, really like it. And then lastly, same belt, cream crop turtleneck, because why not? We love a crop situation with a very long situation. That little sliver of skin is always gonna do it. This is one of the most covered looks of this little styling video, and it's one of the sexiest. It's so sleek, it's so easy, and I absolutely plan to wear this when the weather warms up just a little bit more. And that's it, y'all. What are your thoughts? What was your favorite look of these handful of looks? Most importantly, what do you think of this format with me talking through the looks? Again, like I said, the next time I'm going to talk whilst dressing, but something tells me that may be a little bit chaotic, but something also tells me that you guys would like that type of chaos. So let me know down below. Of course, I will link the dress down below because I know it's still available. As far as the separate pieces that I paired with the dress, I will do my best to find them or things pretty similar to them. I will also link what I'm wearing down below because I'm obsessed. This is Sammy B for Target and I believe that it is still available and very much on sale because I got it on sale and that makes me very happy. Like this video if you like this video. Are you into maxi skirts this season or are you still very much for the mini because that was a pretty big trend last year. She's still lingering. So which one, maxi or mini? Or midi. Follow me on Instagram at Born in Sequins. And follow me on TikTok at Brittany Inc. And I will see you beautiful people in the next video.